welcome to or welcome back to the channel today we are getting ready for alabama truck meet which is this coming saturday and i'm gonna have plenty of footage of that so today we are getting the truck ready to take it to the show get it cleaned up um we're going to do our safety check on everything tomorrow which is basically where i lift up the front end check all the bearings make sure everything in the front end is safe um check the back and uh, basically just go through the truck and make sure that it can go 120 miles an hour. Um, but today we're going to wash it, clean it up. We got some ceramic spray. Unfortunately, the incredible job that Insane Paint and Auto Detailing did five years ago is finally wearing off. So we're just gonna do like some maintenance cheap spray that's been out for years and years and uh, it's for consumers now and then hopefully sometime soon I'll get them to do another job on it. But anyway, let's get started. So this stuff doesn't replace what a professional um, detailing company can do. But this hybrid solution ceramic spray coating is uh, pretty good. So basically all you do is spray it on Take you a microfiber towel. Make sure you get it on there real good. And then take you a new one and make sure you rub it in. That really, really helps a lot. So yeah, there you have it. I guess I have the RC car connected to my camera. It actually works really well as both a stand and a. Uh, Dolly. Yeah, we're gonna fish the truck and then uh, we'll be done. There you go. This uh, one side's pretty much done, so I need some wiping. But um, this is a 5K camera, so obviously, when you look at your phone, it'll be 1080p because anything over 1080p is basically. Reduced to 1080p. But yeah, looks pretty good. So we're gonna finish it up and I'll get one of the hood. Let me do a little before and after on the hood. So I don't know if you'll even be able to see anything, but that's the hood before. And then the next shot will be after. So I don't know if y'all can tell <clears throat> tell a difference. But this is the side with the ceramic coating, and then this is the side without. So you can see how that looks on the computer, but not too bad. Almost ready for Alabama truck meet, so we'll we'll get there. This stuff uh, cleaned it up pretty nice. There's a few spots that need need rubbing, and I still need to get the bumper, but yeah, not too not too bad. Let's see if we can get it in the get us a little uh, thumbnail there. Pretty cool stuff. So we're gonna finish this bumper because I forgot it. Man, this thing needs a new paint job. It might look immaculate on the camera. I don't know, but if you're looking, if you look up close, it looks pretty rough. But anyway, I'm gonna finish this up and then get my wife's car done and call it a day. All right. 
right, so got the truck in the basement overall. Uh, pretty happy with the stuff. I mean, it's not it's not bad, but it's a whole lot easier than than wax, and um, it's supposed to last up to a year. It's hydrophobic, UV protectant. Um, all in all, it's not bad for what it is. Um, it certainly doesn't replace professional ceramic coating. Uh, nothing does. I mean, that stuff, stuff like this is probably like the first ceramic coating that came out years ago. Um, that only lasted about a year. And then they figured out how to, you know, make it easy for consumers to just spray it on and then take it off. So, uh, certainly not as good as the new stuff that's out. But... I mean, it's not bad, and the truck is super smooth. Um, it feels really smooth to touch, and um, I didn't put any water on it because I wanted it to dry thoroughly, but all in all, I'm pretty happy with it. Uh, wasn't really a how-to video, um, really even wasn't a review video, but um, all in all, it's not bad. And if you're in a pinch, definitely check it out. It might actually, I don't know this for sure. This probably could be used as like a refresher for a ceramic coating. Um, I don't know that. Some of you detail guys could chime in there. Um, but I do know that some of the ceramic coating uh, refreshes, I've got some somewhere, um, is basically just a spray on and wipe off type stuff. Um, yeah, it's not bad. We'll see how it does. Insane water beating and chemical resistant protection for up to 12 months. So, I uh, would expect it to last six months, maybe. But either way, not having to wax the truck, this stuff's really good. Um, I probably put it on and took it all off in less than an hour. So, not a bad, not a bad application. And it looks really good. So, I don't know how well y'all can see in here. Um, but, I mean, it's pretty impressive for what it is. Do a quick walk around. So the hood's taken a beating over the years. But yeah. So, appreciate y'all watching. Um, if you want to, subscribe. I got more stuff coming. And I got some reaction videos coming, so make sure you watch out for that. And, uh... Yeah, hit the like button, trying to grow the page a little bit more and put more effort into it and got more stuff coming. So thanks for watching.